Hi, this is Barrett from rhinestonealphabets.com. And when you're looking at the RAS Athletic Regular Combo, it works like all our combo fonts where the inside of the word is with the lower case letters and the outside is most of the time the um, caps lock on. And if you look at the chart, it's going to tell you how to instantly size them so you don't have to fiddle in Cricut because one of the issues that I have found in working in Cricut is you, uh, Cricut looks at those circles as huge amounts of information. And if you can size them according to a point value and know that that size is going to be the correct size, it will make um, it work 10 times easier. So what we have done is taken, um, figured out the sizing because in Cricut you size it a little differently than with Corel um, or Silhouette, which is the above sizing. So let's look at 231, if you can remember that, and 185. And let's just go into the, um, first we'll go into um, Silhouette Studio. So when we go into Silhouette and open up that font, which is called the RA Athletic Regular Combo, you are going to be sizing that at 231, which if you see right here, I put in 231. So that is sized perfectly for an SS10 stone. And what there's a lot of ways you can do the other part of it. You can, so I have the caps lock on here. And if I just remove the caps lock and type a S, you're gonna get the inside, but one thing that I have found that's um, easy and fast is if you duplicate it and then I just double click on it and take the caps lock off and I type in shine. And so now I've got the inside of the word and basically this is ready to go to your cutter. But let's go ahead and release the compound path by ungrouping, of course, and and then you can kind of see that the stone size is 0.135, which is going to size really well um, for SS10 rhinestones. And then the other way you do it is in um, Cricut Design Space, is you are going to be using a font size of 185. So let's just take, to make this easier, let's just take the word sun. And again, you find the font in the system, type a 185. Again, there's a couple ways to do this. You can duplicate it, which I kind of like to do because then it's already sized. So let's just go ahead and grab that. And um, duplicate it. And then if I double click on it, I can take the caps lock off on my computer and type the other part. So now that is the second part of the word. And I'm just going to add some color here. And then you can uh, um, see how it aligns. So it's basically. Uh, Sometimes with Cricut, it's a little bit funny, but rest assured when we created the fonts, they are lined up perfectly. So as long as you size them the same, you're going to have a perfect lineup, whether or not Cricut does the alignment correct. Again, it's um, a perfect alignment. So uh, double to double check that, of course, you could um, grab that and um, let's see here, combine it, weld it, and then contour it. And again, this is really laborious for Cricut to do to go through this step. But rest assured, when we created these figured out the sizing. We're looking at an SS um, 
10 rhinestone size. So I'm hoping that that makes sense. And if you have any other questions, please feel free to let us know. We'll try to answer 